Hey guys, it's Mandy. Welcome to my beginner series. This is a series of 10 videos focused on getting that body warmed up and ready for more intermediate or advanced level workouts. Today we are specifically focusing on glutes. So this is going to be a beginner glute workout. Join me on your mat tabletop here to start. All right. So nice flat back, pull the belly button up and just a quick stretch, taking your hips down and over to the right, take them back to the side. Come back through your tabletop and hips go down and over to the left. Come back to the middle. Nice flat back here. And then extend your right toes back, just stepping that foot behind you. Let's go ahead and add a small lift and tap. If your wrists get a little tired, if you're not used to working out or being on those wrists, it's perfectly fine to come down to a forearm position, okay? Common mistake here would be for you to start swaying your back, okay? Taking the movement and the work from your glute and putting it into your back, let's go ahead and pause for a moment, correct that, flex your core, and just think about squeezing the right glute as you tap and lift. For five, four, three, two, and hold it up. Bend your knee, pull the heel into the glute, and kick out. So work that booty, work your hamstring. We're sculpting back there. Press into your right hand, even out your weight. Keep the rest of your body really still and you're already doing a great job, making it further into this video than most people would, right? So just extend five, four, three. Oh, I know you feel that burn. I do too. Last one and release. Little shimmy, okay? Switching sides left. Just tap and lift. Once again, you know that good form now, okay? So press into your left hand and lift, keeping the leg straight. If you notice the back starts to sway or bend, don't lift your leg quite as high. There's no need to do that, right? I really just want you focusing on your left side. Four, three, oh, I'm getting into it. Last two, and hold, bend the knee and kick. Bend and kick. So just lengthening out. Notice that I'm not kind of popping my hip up or dipping down or hunching, looking back at my knees, right? So we want to lift up the chest. Look out and forward. Three, two, and one. Drop that knee down. Take your right knee and just press back. Press back. Point your toe up to the ceiling. Squeeze and lift. Squeeze and lift. Go ahead and lower to your forearms if those wrists are tired. Five, four, three, two. Lift up and circle that knee all the way around. Ooh, this is gonna be a little harder. It's gonna challenge you, but you're here to get a little bit of a challenge, okay? So squeeze and around the top of that circle. Three, two, doing great. Last one. Ooh, left knee goes straight back and down. Pull your heel in and keep it pulled in. So imagine there's a rubber band going from around that ankle to the top of the thigh. So you gotta hold the heel into the booty. Four, three, you know those circles are coming in two. And one, take it around. Ooh, big lift, big lift. Even your core works as you round the top of that circle, pressing into your hands and looking at the mat. Not at the knees, but down at the mat. Three, two, woo, and one. Relax, swing your legs around, changing up that position. Take the feet out on the edge of the mat and roll the body down. Woo, all right. Pull the, I'm t pull, pull your pants up. You don't need to pull your pants up. I need to pull my pants up. All right, from here, try to tickle your fingertips to the heels, okay? Pulling them in just a little bit, and then we're just going to squeeze the glutes up. One vertebrae at a time, roll down onto the mat, okay? Press up, roll down. Keeping that squeeze in the glute all the way down, and then release right at the end. Lift up, roll down. Good job. This is more challenging than you'd think, right? Because you can feel it in your glutes, in your hamstrings, and actually in your core. Okay, so flex all the way down. Like you're doing the wave with your body here. 
down. Two more. This is gonna be your last one. Roll all the way down. Press up and hold for me. And tap the mat, regular little drop, and lift in your bridge, down and lift. When you're in the bridge, your bridge position, the knees are gonna stay still right over the ankles, so try not to let them wobble in and out. We wanna hold them there. Squeezing the glutes up, you're actually flexing your cheeks together and lifting up, just for to get graphic about it. All right, lift up and then tap down. Squeeze your belly, tap down, squeeze the belly. Six, five, four, they should be worn back there. Last three, two, and you're gonna hold up right there. Lift your right heel, lift left. Just right, just left, without releasing that squeeze, okay? So you gotta keep the squeeze, keep the hips up for five, four, three, two, and one, release. You can give them a brief little break. Good job, good job, shimmy shimmy, and squeeze back up into that bridge. This time, take your knees in, tapping the inner thighs, and then press out. Knees in, press out, in, press out. So kind of moving the weight from the inside of your foot to the outside, inside, outside, without letting the glutes drop. This is really getting into your backside. It is normal for you to feel the burn right now. Out and in, let's take a deep breath. Five, four, are you squeezing the core? Last three, two, and one away to hold your knees wide, lift your hips up high, hold, 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 you've got this, you've got this. Take your hands up and go ahead and press them down to the floor. We're gonna reach up, lower those hips and press. Lower and press. Five, four, three, two, weight is in my heels. Last one, hold, press down through those palms, lift your hips and relax. Knees come into the chest. Very gently give them a hug. Whoo, stretch, stretch, stretch. Roll side to side if your back needs a little bit of a break. That's okay. All right, now the feet come together. So zip up those legs. Try to touch your heels again, getting them a little bit closer. But of course, if you need to move them in or out, you have my permission to do that too, okay? Lift those hips back into bridge. From here, the knees wanna drop out. Right, but let's activate the inner thighs a little bit and then squeeze those hips up an inch. Little lift, lift, lift. Six, five, four, three, two. And you're already so close. Let's wrap the right leg on top of left. Oh, now everything is shifted into your left glute. Lift those hips up, inner thighs squeeze, hold. Ah, take a deep breath. Slowly let's drop those hips and lift up. If the one-legged bridge is too much work for you and you wanna take a break, we're not ready for that yet, perfectly fine to place the right foot on the floor. Just three, two, and one. Let's swap it out. Cross those legs, tap the hips and lift. Tap those hips and lift. Very gentle, lift and lift. Four more, three, two, and lift and hold. We're almost through with bridges. Release, woo, knees come into the chest. Couple of rock and rolls. Try to make your way all the way up to a forward fold or just find your way here and meet me in this position however you can, okay? Let's bend your left knee and bend the right knee. Take that right foot back to a lunge. Hands come to heart center, the hardest thing yet. This is how we're gonna finish things off. Squeeze that booty, get your balance, and from here, lunge, and let's kick the back leg. Lunge, little kick. Lunge, little kick. Kick. This is getting into your glutes and your legs, even your core. Squeeze your tush. Squeeze it up. Lift. Lift. Just six. Five, last four, three, it can be tiny, last two, and one. Hold it up, hold it, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Keep your gaze locked in, 
to hold the balance and then release. Great job. Left leg goes back, lunge it out. Good job. All right, from here, you can make it through this last little bit, okay? Lunge down, kick up, lunge down, kick up. That's the smallest little flex. Just kick and kick. Great job. If you lose your balance, don't get discouraged. I lose my balance all the time, okay? All the time, and then you just get back into it. Four more. Three, two, last one. Hold it up. Woo! Soft bend, standing leg, and release. Oh, quick little break. Great job. Inhale, hands come up high. We're gonna finish with a forward fold, quick stretch. Release. Bend left knee, stretch out that booty. And then bend right knee, stretch it out on that side. Great. Soft bend in both knees. Roll it up one vertebrae at a time. Nice and slow. Great job. You made it through my beginner glute workout. There's more advanced workouts if you want to try one of those next. Or you can continue on until you feel you're ready. Repeat this video or try one of the other videos in my beginner series. Thanks, guys.